Sports is an opportunity to, to go into a, a campus community and to add another layer of belonging, right? So there were the athletes, there were the performing arts, student leaders, speech and debate. Now there's eSports. I think anytime we can give a school another pathway or opportunity to bring more people into the conversation about what campus culture looks like and who's represented, it's a win. And so eSports for us has been just an, a great opportunity to open up that conversation, to give kids an opportunity, and to grow school culture. Esports is special for a couple of different reasons. Um, first of all, it gives kids that are sometimes not involved in other school activities a chance to really be involved, play for their school, and shine, um, which has been amazing. The kids teach me so much about strategy, communication, teamwork. Um, I oversee nine different competing teams currently, and I've had as many as 12. And just the way that these groups of kids come together and collaborate, um, all different grades and ages, and just really coming together as a team, and it's really inspiring to watch that. I think a lot of stories that we hear is that this opportunity is reaching out to a subset of kids that don't want to play football, don't want to play basketball, maybe don't want to be in music, and that's really truly what Chassa is. It's finding those niches that our kids and, and evolving with where our kids are today. And game, we weren't even talking about gaming 15 years ago, but we are talking about it in 2022. I'm like pushing everything to the limit right now, pushing all the limits, finding out new ways to play the game, finding new uh, like techs or whatever what I'm doing, how to find a way how to approach and everything, new, learning new ways how to play the game basically. Having Chasa support esports in Colorado has been a huge boost for us for legitimacy for the most part um, because it immediately brings it to an understandable level for administration and athletic directors. They know the people working with Chassa um, and it brings that level of legitimization to esports that it is a competitive thing that kids are doing on a similar level to speech and debate or mock trial or something like that. I think it's wonderful that Chassa is supporting esports now here in Colorado because it's showing that esports is starting to be recognized as a, a viable and kind of legitimate operation. It's no longer like it's just kids playing video games. It's a, a bona fide opportunity for students to take, you know, use their gaming skills for something other than just recreation. This has been a huge step. Uh, to be able to partner with Chassa uh, as both at the local level and the state level because for the, it's really, honestly, it's about these kids. Uh, it's about legitimizing all this work that they put in and, and the activity that they love so much and they love playing. Um, it, gives, it just gives them an opportunity to be able to legitimize everything that they've been doing. Uh, our partnership in Colorado with, with Play Versus has been awesome. I love that, that we get to meet every week with our Play Versus rep and talk about what's good, talk about maybe some of the things that we need to, to fix. Um, I think that one-on-one, -on -one, that, that weekly meeting for me has meant everything. And not only that part of it, but I think it's just having that access. 